Yo, 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 I'm back. So today I decided to make a beat of Reason and Studio One VSD plugin. Um, I'm not going to waste your time. I make a full song using some sound from Splice. So, um, so let's work. All right, so I start with the uh, guitar VSD from um, Reason. I came up with the chord and um, add some effects to it. Yeah. So it's for the effects, it's just a EQ and a reverb. Let's see. After that, I just activate the ghost note and add a string. I basically play the root notes of the uh, chord. So I always keep my beats as basic as possible. Um, I don't want to be too complicated. See, as you can see, I'm still playing the same notes, but in different um, variation. Yeah, that's how it sounds together. With uh, the guitar and the string playing at the same, I, I mean, yeah, the strings playing at the same time. So then I decided to add a bell, a lead. Uh, I chose a bell sound, and all these sounds are coming from Reason. <coughs> uh, I just add that effect to it, just to, um, cause it was really harsh the bell. So. I, yeah. See, nothing crazy. And for the bell sound, I basically follow the same chord pattern. Yeah, so as you can see, I just follow the chord and then I just lower the active one octave, one octave down. So this is how I did my um the drum for the track. Let me I'll let you hear the um the pattern I came up with. Uh, I kept it basic to nothing crazy, you no know. um yeah. Just a few hi hat rolls here and there. Just to give it some swing. Yeah, the drum, you could do whatever you want, but that's how I like mine. For the open hats, I, you know, I put some delay on it so it hits before the beat. I don't like the sound on there, but hey, I kept it because I didn't have much time.
go with the 808 or our base. Whatever you want to add. So, again, once again, I follow the chord. Um, this 808, I decided to use Reason Europa. Instead of uh, a sample. Yeah, so... As you can see, every... Um, every sound playing in this in this beat basically following the same pattern as the chord you just follow the chord most of the time you can't go wrong some ch um, sounds I found on a kit. I forgot which kit it was. <laughs> and I just pitch up and down. Um, the, the chant of following the same pattern again. I guess, yeah, the hello too. It's following the same pattern. So like I said, everything from the beat following, following the chord. Basic. So yeah, then I went to Splice. I found some rap vocals and added as as a hook for the song. So let me I'm about to turn off the the effects. Okay, so that's like the dry vocal. So yeah, but anyway, so I'm gonna let you hear the whole track I came up with. Sorry, I had to cut through it because I didn't have time. Plus, my daughter was in the background. So, just hear the the, the whole beat. your own verse you can write your own verse or your own hook that's really up to you i just wanted to show you how i come up with my own um song if i would like to make one but that's about it thank you for watching